Hey lovelies, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kendrick and today I'm going to be showing you what is on my iPhone 11. So I did this video a couple months ago, but it has obviously changed, so I thought I would show you guys since you guys really seem to be interested in that. So if you are new here, make sure you subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you would like to see more videos, and let's just get right into the video. So I have the same screensaver as last time, it's just these clouds, so yeah, let's open the phone. So I have my face ID, and I'll open it up. So on the first page, you just see the basic apps that Oh, your phone comes with obviously so i have facetime calendar photos camera mail clock maps weather reminders notes stocks books apple store podcast tv news health home wallet settings music phone safari and contacts that is a lot then at the bottom we have messages spotify instagram and snapchat so um obviously messages is for my messages and then spotify is for listening to music obviously i'm a spotify person and let's just say i am right now playing my Christmas playlist and Michael Bublé Christmas because that is just literally the best. Have a holly, jolly Christmas. It's the best time of okay, probably gonna get copyrighted for that, but um, yeah, I just like listening to music. I absolutely love listening to Christmas music. I know it's still a couple months away, but I just like to listen to it, so um, yeah. So then next we have Instagram, and obviously Instagram is for posting pictures and stuff like that. So you should definitely follow my Instagram, it's linked down below. I like to post, you know, like outfits and stuff like that, and also just interact with you guys as well. So, um, I'll give like heads up for new videos and like polls for what you want to see on my channel and like Q&As and stuff like that. So definitely check out my Instagram if you'd like. And then we have Snapchat. I don't really use Snapchat to um, post stuff and like snap people, but I do like using it to see what celebrities are doing and stuff like that and see what's new and stuff like that. So also their filters are pretty cute. They have some pretty cute filters. So yeah, that is the first page. Then when you go to this next page, the first folder you have is this random folder and this literally just has a bunch of apps that come with the phone but couldn't fit on the first page so I just threw them all in this random folder so you can just look at that if you want. Then we have utilities. This one is just I guess stuff that like I kind of use but not like on a daily basis so there's like voice memos, compass, measure and calculator, an apple watch. I don't have an apple watch so it's not really necessary but I have it there. Then we have finance. I won't go into too too much detail with finance because it is like personal stuff, but I have PayPal, my banking app, Shopify, and the shop app so that I can keep track of shipments and stuff like that. So I use that to keep track of shipments and keep track of my money. So that's what that's for. Then we have shopping, some of my favorite apps. So we have Grailed, which is like a little reselling app. I don't usually sell on it, but I have bought a couple of things on it. So they have some really cute stuff on there too. Then we have Wish. I haven't used Wish in a long time, but they do have some pretty nice stickers that I usually use and they're very inexpensive. So I thought I would, you know, take a look at that. Then we've got Poshmark. Love Poshmark love to buy stuff on Poshmark. I'm not actually selling on Poshmark yet, but I do really like to buy, so I thought I'd download it. Then we have Uber Eats. I really like Uber Eats because I like food, so I downloaded it so that I can deliver food to my house, so that worked out well. <laughs> then we have Depop. You should follow my Depop, it'll be linked down below, but this is how I sell my clothes and stuff like that. I just go on this all the time. I'm always looking, always looking to shop and stuff like that. So definitely check out my Depop if you are interested in buying some pretty cute clothes. Next we have AliExpress. I've never actually used AliExpress before, but I downloaded it because it's easier than using it on like Safari or something like that. So I've never actually bought from here, but maybe I'll do it one day. So who knows? Then we've got eBay. Love eBay for buying 
like packaging supplies and stuff like that. I just bought a camera off of eBay, so my vlog camera will be coming in very, very soon. Super excited for that. Then we have the Starbucks app. I love the Starbucks app because I can easily, easily order stuff and then go to my Starbucks and pick it up. Then we have the Garage app. Uh, I don't usually go shopping at Garage too much, but they do have some pretty great offers and deals and stuff like that when you purchase. So I downloaded that so that I can get those deals. And that is the shopping folder. And now we have games. So I have a lot of games. I get tired of games very easily, so I download a lot. We have Heads Up, which is like basically headbands if you've played that game before. And then we have Spiral Roll, Candy Crush, Dune, Temple Run, Ice Cream Drop, Subway Surf, Snake vs. Block, and Stickman Hook. I think out of all of these, my favorites are Stickman Hook. I really like Stickman Hook. It's a really fun game to play. So I really like playing this. I play it all the time. And um, yeah, this is so fun. Okay, anyways, I could play that for hours. So that is the game stuff. I really like to go on my phone and just play games. So I have a bunch that are like really crappy games, but they're kind of fun too. Then we have socials. This is actually kind of like a weird combination. But first I have followers and that's basically to show like who unfollows me and who blocks me on Instagram. That's just like kind of the random stuff that I like to know. So I have that. Then I have my Pinterest absolutely love Pinterest. I love looking at recipes and like inspiration. So Pinterest is like one of my favorite apps. I use it a lot. Then we have TikTok. I love TikTok so I use it very often. Then I have my YouTube studio and I like to use this to just see my stats on YouTube and stuff like that so I can see how many views my videos are getting and stuff like that. I can also do this on my laptop but it's super 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 easy to have it on my phone so wherever I am I can just check and reply to comments and stuff like that so it's super super easy. Then I have YouTube of course so I can watch videos so that's super super fun. Then I have, this isn't really social but I have my Christmas countdown app so as you can see, I really, really like Christmas, so that's so much fun. So as I'm filming this, you can see how many weeks and days and sleeps and hours and minutes and heartbeats and breaths until Christmas. So I really like this app. It's really fun. And you can switch out the character as well. So then we have school. I also won't go into too much detail with this because it's like kind of boring, but I have Google Classroom, Slack, Google Hangouts, Google Drive, Gmail, and then my school board app, which doesn't really work, but that's a whole other problem. And then we have editing. All of my editing apps are the same as they were last time. The only difference is I have Adobe Draw, and this is really great to like draw stuff, so it's kind of like Procreate, but like not as good. <laughs> So if you're looking for something to draw with on your phone, definitely check that out. I have a video on how I edit my thumbnails and I go into detail with the apps that I use. So you should definitely check that out if you're interested. Then I have my maps. So I have my bus app, Google Maps, and then I have COVID Alert, which is basically this app that tells me if I've been near anyone who has had a diagnosis of COVID through the app. So looks like I'm good. So that's really good. <laughs> That is pretty much everything that's on my phone. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I love you all so much. Thank you guys for 750 subscribers. Oh, also, look what came in the mail. This bag is what I'm going to be giving away for my giveaway when I reach 1,000 subscribers. So make sure you subscribe and I will be giving away this little backpack. I absolutely love Kankin backpacks, so I thought I would give this away because I love it so much. So it's brand new. And I'm really, really excited to give this away to one of you guys. So yeah. Anyways, I love you guys all so, so, so much. I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.